Hey guys, it's Tim from Tim's Tiny Arcade, and today I want to talk about co-op games that I played as a kid on the Atari 2600. Sure, there was a lot of games like Asteroids, Missile Command, and those, you know, style of games where you just would shoot for a high score and you could play by yourself, but uh, me and my brother played a lot of uh, co-op couch kind of games also back in the day, and I want to show you guys a few of my favorites that uh, we used to play, and uh, maybe a little footage of some of these games and talk about them. Duke Nukem, and you're watching Tim's Tiny Arcade, Mother Effer. Okay, guys, so one of the games me and my brother played quite a bit of uh, co op was a game called Air Sea Battle. This came out in uh, 81 and was a uh, game that we spent a lot of time playing. Very simple game. Let me show you a little bit of gameplay on some right, Air guys, Sea Battle. So, this is a look at uh, one of the game modes of uh, Air Sea Battle. We played this game all the time. There was a lot of different game modes. This is one of the uh, ones we'd play a lot where you had to take out the ships, um, get different points. You could move and um, shoot, but uh, just a lot of competitive games we would play. And uh, we spent endless time playing these games, just trying to beat each other. And, uh, you know, that was kind of the fun of it, uh, competing against someone else. Uh, and trying to beat their score. Let me show you a different game mode of this. Another mode is that you could uh, be a plane, you could slow up, drop bombs, and score points that way, and the, some of them were worth different points. But it was kind of like an arcade style game. It was a lot of fun. Um, I think a lot of people might have owned this game back in the day. But simple game, uh, kind of a arcade premise, and uh, just a lot of fun. So Air Sea Battle is one of the games I played quite a bit with my brother uh, growing up. All right, the next game, Warlords. This was, I believe, the first Atari 2600 game uh, that I actually played. This was a paddle game, and you could play up to four players. And let me tell you what, this game's what really got me started on the Atari 2600 was Warlords. Super fun game. Uh, this was also an arcade game, but well done on the Atari 2600. I'll show you a little bit of gameplay. Um, you didn't have to play four players. You could have the others as computers, but it was more fun always playing with uh, other uh, people in your family or friends uh, and try to beat them instead of the computer. All right, guys, so I'm actually playing one player um, just because I don't have anyone else here to play with me, but um, I'm in the upper left, the yellow. Now you could catch the fireball. There we go, I caught it. Um, Computers are kind of uh, like one, you know, some of the computers were easy, some of them were a little more tough, but this game definitely is a lot more fun playing uh, um, more players. And uh, back in the day, the paddles, you'd play these with paddles, and you'd have uh, a set of paddles, you could play two players, so if you plugged in two sets, then you could have a four player game. But yeah, I always liked it also, like when you uh, hit the bricks, you could see like the ghost of the. Uh, Watch, I'll shoot these bricks here. You can see like the ghost of the uh, enemy that's dead. Well, I miss because I, but yeah, as you see it hit bricks, you can see like the bottom left guy still like kind of flash. But yeah, a lot of fun. Um, I actually played this a lot. And like I said, this was like the first Atari 2600 game I believe I played. All right, guys. So uh, we also, uh, me and my brother played a lot of sports games and Activision had a couple great ones. Uh, I'm just going to show one of these, and uh, I'll just probably play a little bit of the ice hockey. But, uh, yeah, we played a lot of ice hockey and a lot of boxing, and these were great two-player games. Um, yes, you could play against the computer, but a lot more fun playing against uh, your brother in this game. And uh, other games that I don't have, uh, I didn't pick out, were some other sports games, because we did play a lot of sports games. We played football. We played home run baseball. But uh, I wanted to showcase a few of the Activision games also because we played a lot of those. So let's take a look at ice hockey now. All right, guys, so let me show you a little bit of ice hockey. This was a two-on-two -two game. Um, I'm actually playing this one against the computer just to show you some gameplay. I'm the one in blue and red. But, yeah, a lot of fun. You could knock the other person down. Um, usually the games were pretty high score. Not like a typical hockey game, but... Um, yeah, there was a lot of uh, time spent playing this game. 
Um, very competitive game. Uh, just trying to beat the other players, score the most goals. I always like just not trying to knock the other players down. I'm not doing a very good job here. Um, but as you see, as the puck goes left and right on the uh, on your stick, and that's how you would fire, hit the button, whatever angle it was on, then you could uh, get your shot off. But yeah, see, I got three goals, and we only, the game was only three minutes long. Um, but we played this game a ton. Um, like I said, I could have showed boxing, I could have showed some other ones, but I'm just going to show hockey. Um, a lot of the sports games we played all the time. Uh, may not always been the best graphics or uh, any of that, but to us back then, it was uh, it was like playing the real thing, you know. So anyway, that guys, that was a look at ice hockey on the, by Activision. Okay, guys, so the last game I'm going to showcase on uh, today's video is Combat. Now, Combat is one of the best games, that uh, two-player games that I think you can play on the Atari 2600. As you see, I have many different uh, variants of this game. So the one there on the left here um, is like the, uh, the original Combat, and then later uh, copies came out with labels. I actually have the instructions of combat. I actually have a box copy. Like I said, this was the pack-in game for the Atari. And this is a Sears uh, Telegames, and it was called Tank Plus. Um, as you can see, it had 27 game modes. Um, great game to play. I mean, the only knock I had on this game was, even though we're talking about co-op, you know, uh, this only was co-op, so if you bought the Atari 2600 and wanted to play uh, a single-player game, this was your only game, you could not play it. But uh, let's take a look at a little bit of combat, and then we'll wrap this video up. All right, guys, so this is a look at one of the game modes. Um, obviously, this is uh, I don't have anyone else playing, but one of my favorites was uh, the one where you could ricochet the bullets. Um, there were several different game modes. Like I said, this was a pack-in game for the Atari 2600, so if you had someone else to play, um, this was the game, man. I'm telling you, I love playing this game, you know, driving the tank around, um, trying to take out the other person, uh, and have bragging rights. Let me show you another game mode real quick that I would play a lot of. All right, so another game mode I love playing was uh, Invisible Tanks. The only time you could see... Uh, where you were is when you shot. Also, uh, steerable bullets. So as you can see, I'm steering my bullets. But yeah, you didn't know where you were unless you uh, shot or ran into the wall. Super fun game. Uh, one of the best co-op games I think uh, made for the Atari. It's a shame there wasn't a computer mode for those people that didn't have a chance to uh, um, play this game if they didn't have anyone to play with. So. But we're doing we're talking about co-op games, and like I said, this is one of my favorites. All right, guys. So that was a look at some of my favorite uh, co-op games on the Atari 2600. There were other ones, uh, Video Olympics, uh, Canyon Bomber. Like I said, I named a lot of sports games. But uh, let me know in the comments what uh, some of your favorite co-op games were uh, growing up. Uh, please like and subscribe to my channel, guys. I appreciate you guys all watching. Until next time, keep on gaming.